going to be making a replica of David Gilmour's famous black strap. At first glance, it seems as though it's just a basic 60s strap with a black pit guard. But I managed to track down a copy of a very rare book written by David Gilmour's guitar tech, Phil Taylor, that goes into extreme detail about all the changes David Gilmour had done to the guitar over the years. And I'm going to quite literally replicate his guitar by the book. Starting off, I'll be using an alder body, a one-piece maple neck with a soft V profile, Godo tuners, a USA Fender tremolo, a custom-made black acrylic pit guard along with a custom-made mini tremolo arm, and the pickups going into this will be a Seymour Duncan SSL 5 in the bridge, a Fender Custom Shop 69 in the middle, and a Fender Custom Shop Fat 50s pickup in the neck. The original black strat at one point was routed for a Kaler tremolo that was later removed and a block of wood was placed into the body so the original tremolo could be reinstalled. I'm going to replicate the appearance of the repairs rather than compromise the structural integrity of the body. David had also drilled a large hole on the edge of the body by the output jack so that an XLR jack could be installed. This too was removed and repainted and again I will be replicating the appearance of the repair rather than compromising the body's structure. Smoke on the 
firing on David Gilmour's Strat is pretty interesting. He has a mini toggle switch in between the volume and tone knobs that's wired so that you can engage the neck pickup in addition to whatever pickup combo the five-way switch is on. This means that in addition to the pickup selections on a traditional Strat, you're able to run the bridge and the neck pickup together without the middle pickup, and you're also able to run all three pickups at the same time. in your own custom guitar or bass, reach out to us on Facebook or check out our website. The links are in the description. <laughs>